Hi everybody, welcome to a new series of tutorials on DRC from Imaginando. Before I start, I'd like to say that uh, I have five codes uh, which will allow you to unlock the synth engine. So if you are uh, interested and if uh, you are a subscriber, just follow the instructions which are included in the comments section of the YouTube video, not in the description, just in the comments. So if you can't see the comments, just expand the comment section. Um, follow the instruction to enter the competition. Um, in this first video, what I'm going to show you is, uh, I'm going to talk a little bit about the interface, but not so much because I want to focus very much uh, on, uh, on how it sounds. It's um, a polyphonic synth. As you can see, I'm running it inside um, AUM at the moment, so AUV3 compatibility, but as well all the normal compatibility in terms uh, of uh, running uh, through other application. And, um, and it's great. It's uh, quite effective in terms of sound and it's very much a virtual analog polyphonic synth. It has uh, two oscillators you can see here. A sub oscillator, a noise generator, and but you have also the all the classicals, um, if you like features uh, from a modulation perspective, from a poor performance perspective, but also from a filter perspective, as you can see here. Okay, um, so I'm sure you will enjoy actually using a DRC. You have here a mixer section here's where you can choose your amplitude, but you can also choose effect like delay, reverb chorus etc and then you have a section here for what are called your modifiers as well your envelope generator one two additional setting for lfo one and two and also an arpeggiator so a, a good um, a good set of choices now let's go inside the patch as you can see there are a number of libraries and i will uh, shortly also a number of videos that will uh, uh, talk about um, um, uh, those additional uh, banks and and I will also give away in the future additional codes for those banks. For this video let's focus a little bit on what uh, is contained in the factory um, bank and there are lots uh, as you can see of, um, uh, of presets so instead of going through them all I selected some uh, already which I included in the favorite category of bank. So let's uh, go through some of them, see how they sound and see what you think about and leave, leave a comment to let me know what you think about the synth. <laughs> This is an introductory lead, so really nice. So let's try this Detroit dub. Interesting, really delicate. Let's try this floating spirit. as you can hear and uh, bear in mind this uh, the sound that is coming out from DRC is um, from the DRC on its own so there are no effects which I have applied as you can see I'm inside the UA, uh, AUM and there are no effects applied so let's try these ARPA factory Okay, really nice. Let's um, uh, taste a little bit these headhunter bays. Really 
and eyes, let's go into this magic forest. And this you can, it can be used as a bass, and you can see in the description also as a lead. This is one of my favorite phone at home. Uh, you can uh, imagine these, uh, you know, in a, in a movie like uh, <laughs> E.T. Really nice. Um, you can also create some interesting effects. Uh, listen to these uh, two older brother. So only one key. So you can create some interesting rhythm, uh, rhythmic um, composition, particularly as you use uh, things like arpeggiator inside uh, DRC. So let's try this silk string. I really love uh, string and pad um sounds in general so this is one of my favorite in DRC. So really spacious, really nice, fulfilling string sound, which you can use uh, very much in a lot of your composition. So let's try this some Paul Simon. Okay, let's try this system ready. Really interesting, and let's try one more. Uh, this last one, which is more of a portamento lead uh, type of patch. So you can hear the portamento immediately. Okay guys, I'm going to stop here in terms of demonstration so you got an idea on how uh, the patch sounds in the RC and we'll proceed in the next video to go through um, the controls one by one. Um, I hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Bye!